All right, so here's how you boost your Shopify store revenue in like 30 seconds. All you need to do is make sure that your buy button is always visible. If not, it's gonna be way too difficult for your customer to actually buy things from your store. Okay, so let's look at an example. Imagine this is your store right here on somebody's phone or on their desktop, it doesn't really matter. This is the description that they're reading. There's some images, but there's no buy button. Shopify actually allows you to scroll past the buy button. Here, what you do is, if this is your store text, you have the buy button always visible no matter where they are on the page. Whether it's the bottom, the top, it doesn't matter. But as soon as they're done reading your ad copy, they're ready to buy. They click on the buy button, and then you made a sale. If they can't find the buy button, you just lost a sale. They have the buy button, you gain a sale, you make more money, you increase your conversions, you go retire on a yacht or a private island or whatever you do with money. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> but that's it. If you're not doing this, you're losing out on a lot of potential revenue for your Shopify store. Um, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. Uh, so, if you're still here, let me tell you a little about me. So, my name is Mark Kuzmarski, and I am a Shopify app developer. I have looked at a lot of Shopify stores and worked with a lot of clients, and I have helped people uh, boost their revenue. And I am here to help you make sure that your Shopify store actually succeeds. I don't I'm not a self-help guru by any stretch of the imagination. I'm a developer. That's what I do. I look for problems with Shopify and I make it better. I fix it. I, I can help your store if you need it, uh, but I would rather just have you install the app that I built. Um, it, it'll, it'll help you increase your conversions. Uh, I'm coming out with new apps to help you increase your conversions. If you need any help getting set up, which you probably won't because nobody's actually had any real issues. I had a couple of people that wanted some help with the styling and whatnot for the button, uh, but that wasn't too bad. Uh, it's, it's a pretty easy uh, setup. Uh, it, it's, it's cool because what it does is it'll match the style of your store so you don't have to spend any time configuring it. It's literally a one-click install. You don't have to mess with any code, you know, nothing. It'll uh, just match your theme. Some other things that you can do that will help uh, boost the conversions with the button is you can, um, when you click on the button, it you can set it so it'll go directly to checkout. So if it goes directly to checkout, uh, the checkout page as opposed to the cart page, your customer doesn't need to click on the, the cart, review it, and then uh, start filling out their contact information. Or if they're a repeat customer, they don't need, uh, they can just get the product right away. Uh, it helps you eliminate clicks because every single click that you eliminate is going to in continue to, to boost your Shopify uh, sales. Also, uh, you can, if you want, you can make the, the, the button like fluorescent green or uh, shaking. I, I have a bunch of different animations and stuff that you can add to the button. So it'll be really, really obvious uh, where the button is uh, on the page. Also, uh, they can adjust the variance. So like, let's imagine you're selling t-shirts or something. If they want to change the size of the t-shirt from medium to large or large to small, they can do that right from the button no matter where they are on the page. So let's imagine uh, this is a picture of, a, I don't know, a sizing chart or something, and they see the the uh, the page, um, if and they see the chart, and they want to be able to uh, adjust the size right from the button without having to scroll up, they can do that. If they want to get seven, they can do that from the button. If uh, they can preview the image from the button, um, it just makes uh, your Shopify store much easier to work with. And this is not limited to desktop. You can do this on mobile. Uh, it just works really, really well. Uh, I, I think it would be a awesome 
addition to your store. And it, honestly, it's kind of required because Shopify doesn't include it by default. Uh, I don't know why they don't. They might at some point in the future. But right now, this is kind of like a bare minimum thing that you need for your store. If your customer can't figure out how to buy or it's not easier, easy for them, they're going to drop out. One of the biggest reasons why people uh, <laughs> don't uh, convert on uh, just online stores in general is because their checkout process is too difficult. If it's easier for your customer, it's going to be easier for you to make more money. The, I, I have, there's a lot of people that close down their stores uh, because they're not doing things like this. There's a lot of other things you need to do. That, I mean, this is this is not enough. I mean, if you only have this button and you have not very good products and you don't have a very good description, people aren't going to buy from you. But if you do have good products and you do have a good description, this is just going to give you that extra nudge that's going to allow your customers to buy. And uh, there's also a free trial on the button too. So you can try it out no problem just um you you should definitely definitely do it okay uh just check out a link somewhere and uh <laughs> you can you can get it all right